Okay, in this video we're going to talk about how you program your barcode reader. The important thing about the barcode reader and why you program it is so that um, it can work faster while you're um, scanning items at the point of sale or doing your, during your physical inventory. Uh, the important thing to do is that you want to have your barcode reader append an enter key after it scans the barcode. The reason why you want that to happen is because the enter key is what Bright Alive uses to go out and search for the inventory item uh, that's been scanned. Otherwise, you kind of have to sit there for about a second waiting for the system to go out and look for it. But when the enter key is seen, it will go out and look for it right away. So for instance, if I go out to the point of sale and I scan a barcode, it will go and look for it right away. Otherwise, if we just typed in that number, you wait for about a second and it goes out. That's just the best way to have your barcode reader uh, set up. So here's how you do it. You would just go into the, the link in the support article down below this video and then you would scroll down, you'd print this out and on this page right here, page 4, um, carriage return simulates enter key. Use this when you scan a barcode. You have to press the enter key to get the item number on the invoice. But what you would do here is you would just go ahead and print this out and scan these three options and you'll hear some codes similar to this. And that's when you know you're successful. The way to test it would be to just go into Bright Alive, scan the barcode. If it scans right away and pulls up the item, you know you've done it successfully. And that's it.